Yes. So that's not to say that's how big they are in this map, that's just what the stats say for it. Yeah. The biggest I've seen in, in any picture is 22 pounds. Um, I personally have caught, what's my biggest pipe? 18.73 was a gold. That had to be right on the fucking edge. Okay, here we go. Up and start my stream back up. Oh, boy. Biggest pike I've caught is 14.99 and it was gold. Oh, yeah, split's still going, okay. <laughs> yeah, no, split's you still said 12 going. Hours. Yeah, we just had the 12 hour mark, so we had to stop and start our streams back up. Oh, okay. Did you hear what I was telling Boris? I was muted, nope. <laughs> said it's awesome that we got a weekend stream to begin with, but an extended weekend stream? Fuck yeah. 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 Damn it. <laughs> you might have to go to the bait shop and switch out some of my baits. Get something a little more price friendly. Does they like swim bait, jerk bait, and spinner bait? Well, the swim baits just don't freaking work anymore. I might have to go get a spinner bait. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck it. I'm gonna go get some spinner baits. It's been a while since I used my bait. I caught my pike on a shad. Poppers and everything. Oh boy. Just grab everything. Pop up on my feet. Um, here. Now you're missing. Nice. <laughs> I had to reload the stream on my phone because it took me back to the beginning of the last stream. Yeah. Huh. Looks like you lost everybody. Oh yeah. They, they probably weren't here to begin with. There's a couple more coming back. Yeah, they're, they're slowly coming back. Alright, time to try to spin a bait out. Double tried and two. I just brought all of them with me. <laughs> I do it. I'm freaking trying, Yeller, okay. 
I do have split stream up, but I'm using my son's phone to watch it, so I can't chat on that one. Oh, good. Oh, there you go. You got one. Silver pike. Yeah. Now the sun's starting to come up. We should start catching a little more. We were in a, there's like a dead zone. Every once in a while, there's a dead zone at like uh, 3 o'clock in the afternoon is a dead zone. And then between 6 a.m. And, and 8 sometimes is a dead zone. Just for some reason, nothing bites. Weird. That's just kind of ironic, because any time I've ever gone fishing, those are like the prime time to get them to bite. Yeah. Well, afternoon's usually not good until the sun starts to go down. Let's change this over to more. There you go. Getting bigger. They're getting bigger. <laughs> yeah. Nice. I got distracted by the name above yours. It's Dr. Cheeseburger. I know. <laughs> <laughs> See some interesting ones sometimes. Well, I guess the no. bong had the reserve. <laughs> nice, at least you're reeling in the musky consistently. At least I'm catching something. Mm -hmm. I ain't too much time trying to freaking get that freaking stupid lake trout. Yeah, it's, it's a it's a grind. Just haven't found a single reliable spot for them yet. Oh, whatever this is, this is huge. Nice. It's fucking fighting. Hopefully it's like <laughs> founder. Watch Dopey get it for me. <laughs> that would just be your luck. Yeah, yeah. Lately. I never, I never get what I'm going for. Like, all the diamonds that I've been catching, not even close to what I was going for. Dude, I don't know, dude. This one's, this one's putting up a fight. The guys over here catching trout are only like level 29 and level 32. Nice. Get all their hacks on this while they're catching lake trout. <laughs> That's supposed to be a good spot, but the only time, uh, a couple times I've been over there, I didn't really get anything. That many in a row? Like, he's just like slaying them out. 
But that's a, the babies, you can catch the little ones. Oh, like, really often. But... Right, what is it? Big pike? It's just a, it's just a freaking big ass pike. 11 pounds. That's a 12 pound pike. I wonder what size, what, what, um, what line are you using right now? Purple one. 22 points. Oh, that's not bad. That's just enough to make it challenging, I think. <laughs> For sure. At the moment, I'm running at best 13 to 15 pound line. I'm using 27 pound braided. I'm not sure. I'm taking this thing. I can't remember. Like, the hook size, like, the where the number is, the bigger the hook is, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. I want to make sure I had that correctly. <laughs> yeah, the size 10 is a little babies. Oh, I caught a point zero. Nine pound um, fish last night. Sardine. Yeah, it was the the minnow that you fish with is the same. Like the, the swim baits are like double the size of the freaking thing. <laughs> really caught me off guard. <laughs> Ooh, that's a big, that's a big pike. Holy crap, it's right there by my boat. It just swam under my boat. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Get back here. The worst part about trying to catch a lake trout is their preferred or their most preferred bait takes forever to sink. That's why I started using the dirt bait. You can just twitch it and it sinks itself. I normally use the jig head just because it's a weighted hook, but I know it says that the lake trout preferred bait spoons. Yeah. Honestly, I'm starting to learn that some of what they say is preferred. It depends on the spot and the time of day. It also depends on the characteristics and traits of the fish, because if you read the, um, the black... Is it, is it cracking? I think it's... No, hold on, give me a second. Let me go look at it real quick. I've noticed sometimes the lures just don't work, depending on the time of day. Right, but some of the fish develop characteristics to where they're less um, shy from humans. And I believe it's the black crappie. That's why they eat, like, the hot dogs and stuff. That the, They don't care. They literally just swim up and they'll eat food that people drop in the water. Mm -hmm. 
it says that in the when you go to the handbook and you push tab on whatever fish you're looking at, it tells you the full description. Come on. Come on. Oh. Well. Yeah. Well, now I'm not getting shit. You're gonna get mad. You're gonna end up coming over here and laying down with me. Why? Jeez. You're just gonna do it yourself. Oh, come on. They waited to bite until I got it all the way up to the boat. I missed it. Oh. Um. I can't believe how much trouble I'm supposed to have with the lock like this. <laughs> Did you see what I commented on the stream, Dopey? Yeah, I saw it. I thought he was messing around at first, but now I'm starting to believe he's actually having a difficult time there. <laughs> You really still haven't caught your sunfish for us? Not at all. Dude, I don't want to do this challenge at all. You've scared me away from it. Ryan got hit immediately. I know, I was... <laughs> he, lit he literally watched it just like swim up to the shoreline. He cast the line right over top of it and got a bite right away. Well, I mean, I've got 20, 25 silvers. I just can't get the gold. Because, like, I can throw on a size 8 hook and catch silvers all day. But if I throw on a size 7, I get nothing. Or I get catfish. I was going to say, you don't get nothing, sir. You got a lot of catfish. Yeah. I trade all those catfish for that one gold just so I can get past the damn challenge. You got like 10,000 credits from all those catfish. Okay. Ended up being more like 15, and then like, I went from level 48 to, oh, what am I now, 52? <laughs> oh, 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 trying to get by. Is he still traveling with the Brokeback uh, face cowboy? Yeah, it sounds like it. Hahaha. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, he's starting to get it. I've hooked the lake trail. What? I hooked the lake trout. If I can reel it in, it'll be my first lake trout catch. Take your time with it and fight it all the way down eventually. Oh, I've already gained about 30 feet of line on it. Oh, yeah, you got it. The hardest part about the lake trout sometimes is just securing the catch. Because it's so they 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 fight like right at the last minute. Literally, as you said that, it almost snapped my line because it was stressing it out. <laughs> Be careful. Try to um. Avoid reeling it in while you're pulling it up to secure it. Sometimes that adds extra uh, tension. Coming out here, I'm about to secure it now. There you go. Nice, seven pounder uh, big trout. This thing's fight like they're twice as big as they really are. It's ridiculous. Yeah, that literally fought about the same as the 15 pound muskie I caught. <laughs> I know, I know he has fun without or and stuff, but I'm really glad to see him actually enjoying this game. Oh yeah. Again, the slowest part about all of this isn't even reeling the line back in, it's literally waiting for the spoon to sink. That's exactly why I started using the crank. <laughs> I'll definitely give them a, a try, I just don't have crank or poppers on me at the moment, because I don't have the um, image. Mm -hmm. I think I also used my size four or size three I was pulling in pretty consistently. Mm -hmm. crazy how difficult all the fish are within the first five levels and then by level 20. There's still a challenge depending on what you catch, but it's like, I used to struggle with that, you know? Yeah. That's why I, I use the souvenir points to buy that five pounds that I really like it. 
It's fine. As long as you don't hook into anything over ten pounds, it's 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 what it's really nice. I kept looking into ten pound catfish while I was trying to get my sun sunfish, and it was just destroying it. <laughs> This is not, this is not working. Then Nick is playing uh, Starfield. How's it going, Glenn? Almost typed that out, but I realized I could just say it. Yeah. Right, fish. Not working good for the spot right now. pretty good. I was playing pool cleaning simulator for oh, like nine nine hours a day. <laughs> I was like, you know what? I'm done with this. I'm gonna drink beer and I'm gonna fish. Yeah, I'm grinding it out. All that for a three pounder? Oh. Actually, yeah, I could use another beer. Me too. Same stupid fish I just let go of. <laughs> I'm actually getting a bunch of bites on a size 6 swim bait. Uh, I mean, so far they're small, but. Catching something. Yeah, I think it is the same stupid fish. <laughs> I 
I don't know that I've ever had that happen. <laughs> Just my luck. So I don't like the whole like catch and release thing. I like to keep yeah. my victims. That way I don't just I, keep catching the same one. How great would it be if there's just a pile of fish in the boat behind you? Dude, that'd be awesome. Right? I think it was you, Twisted, that said something about having a big aquarium. Of all the fish you catch. I'd have to be a hell of an aquarium now. I feel bad about that guy catching all those freaking lake trout. His boat be sinking. <laughs> I'm just saying, Ryan and I could take you to a spot to show you where the boats become semi submersible. <laughs> yeah, they turned their boat into a submarine the other day. I know, I swear this is... I swear, I think I'm catching the same stupid fish over and over again. Same weight. Same type of fish, same weight. <laughs> uh, hey, Bob, if you need me, I'll be down at the main outpost. See you soon. Oh, the tiger must be. I <laughs> see. Fishy, fishy, fishy. Yeah, you didn't know until like halfway through the week that I booked you the entire week off. No. No, because I thought you were going to be hung over all the way <laughs> like from after our anniversary. <laughs> Is there a limit to the catches or sizes of them? Eventually, it'll it'll die down. Like, don't catch as many fish. Yeah. Sometimes you, you just gotta move spots. That's why it's good to just catch a few, move a few feet, catch a few, move a few feet. Yeah, that's why I'm just doing donuts. <laughs> Oh yeah, we did. I think I got like an eight pounder on the line. Yeah. Watch it be like a little shrimp. <laughs> yeah, it very well could be. That does happen sometimes. Pike do fight. The two pound pike. Dude, Depending on what you're using, they can be kind of vicious. I think an anchovy could have ate that mountain white fish I caught last night. Probably. It was tiny. Four and a half pound bass, not bad. Hey. Yes, yeah, there you go. I want to know what the smallest possible fish is, because I think I'm in the running for it there. Somebody caught a 0 0.08 crappy earlier. It was the uh, bottom oh, before you left. <laughs> Holy shit! Like a birth That's, the line. That is way smaller. That's a thousandth of a fucking pound. Ugly. <laughs> is that like ten times smaller? I don't know, it was Bonghead earlier. I'm pretty sure that's probably why they left. I got another one on the line, though. 
Run, you fat pig, get in my boat. He must have been using like eggs or bloodworm on a size 10 to get that. That's the only way I could see that being possible. Another bass. Nice. Ooh, I'm actually getting um bites on the sunbait. I I thought the sunbait didn't work. It's renewing my faith. <laughs> Where's it? Get back here. No, listen, asshole. Oh, you got a nice size, sis. Yeah, you know you can turn your, um, turn your drag up. There, there you go. <laughs> yeah, I see it jumping out of the water fighting you. You got this. Yeah, the dolphin. Eventually. We'll put up a bigger fight. <laughs> oh, just beat a bitch. Uh -oh. My controller is dying. Can you run this lake? Well, you're in a boat. You can just drive around. Lake is like this big. All the way up here. Next into the other one. Open more on that. As long as you're in a there boat, you can just go like that. Thank you. Son of a bitch. There's a big yeah. to the map. If you're new to the game, you only get one real location. You have to literally go to everything to be able to fast travel. From then on out, you can pretty much go wherever. You can even drive your boat up onto the land. You're not gonna, you're not gonna go too far after that, but <laughs> we get jeeps too. I will say this, the jeeps are a lot better than they used to be. The steering used to be so slow on those things. You were careening in the cliff. Extra. I don't know, the last two days we all been trying nice. to... Oh, damn. 13.80 pounds. Over tiger. What are you fishing with again? <laughs> right near you. <laughs> Very nice. Yeah, what, what bait? Oh, minnow. Really? Okay, and I'm, I'm using the wrong hook. shit. I'm using the wrong shit. Let's see. Ooh, I got something big. 
It's just pulling my... Come on. Still pulling on. There we go, I got it. It's big. Come on. Looks like a looks like a pike. Oh, fighting! Mm -hmm. Baits of different sorts. Get crawdads if you can. Hey. You, go to, you go to the bait shop and you, there's like a bunch of different bait. Yeah, live baits. You got like hot dogs and marshmallows and stuff like that, and you got a bunch of different lures. Different hook sizes. We're finally getting to the right time of day. Good day. One o'clock, one thirty, I think it is. Man, Pike used to be a menace. I'm glad they stepped that down a little bit. <laughs> Same thing with the rainbow trout. They're hard to find now. Got another one. Um, I caught a 9.2 pound rainbow trout in that little sea lake that that fox figurine's at. We found, um, there's a, well, was it where's the river? It's in the, it's in the meadow area. The, I don't know what it's called. I don't have any of the stuff unveiled. It's, it's the river by like the radio. I guess still a pain grow up to twenty feet and eat everything away. I've almost got enough for my next tackle box upgrade. Nice. Yeah, they used to be really bad in this game. Like really <laughs> Got another one. Definitely the right time of day all of a sudden. How's it going? Is anyone, is anyone else streaming this now on here? Not that I know. There's a few people. 
Most of them play the hunter though. <laughs> yeah. I joined a few different discords trying to get the uh, inside scoop on the fishing spots. You know? <laughs> yeah. Shit's, this shit's hard to find by yourself when you're just wandering around the map. You gotta spend hours in different spots just to get reliable data on whether or not you're gonna catch something good. Forrest knows the catfish spots. <laughs> I don't wanna talk about it. I don't wanna talk about it. I wish I didn't know that spot. Although, I've never pulled anything bigger than gold out of there. Well, I mean, like small it's gold. The 225 donor. Thank you, man. Oh, hey. Yeah. Oh no, Virus and uh, Twisted are streaming this. Nah. Well, hello. You just parked the boat right in front of me, huh? Boats still go through each other. Can you actually crash into each other with the boat? Uh, they ghost still. So. It'd be yeah. awful if they didn't. Over here trying to pour in a bronze drink, crappy. Yeah. You got a juvenile. <laughs> Point seven. Point yeah. zero seven. Holy crap. Yeah. Just... <laughs> Dude, my thumb is bigger than this fish. <laughs> you gotta get a picture of that. Oh, I did. There, I just sent it in the, uh, the Discord. I can't- where is it? <laughs> God. 
I think I've had bigger fish in my aquarium. <laughs> That is crazy small. Yeah, the challenge is for me to catch a bronze rank one right here. That's what I caught instead. <laughs> If you're using a bobber, do you guys push F to zoom in on it? Do yeah, what? When you're using the bobber, do you push F to zoom in on it? I do. Sometimes you can see the fish before they bite. Yeah. Give me something to do while I wait. <laughs> well. We were getting bite. I know, right? Right until those guys showed up. Scared away all the fish. Hmm. Split broke his game. I, I can hear that. Is your game frozen? Uh oh. Shut up for one. Whoa, it's shaking. No, oh, it looks like it's working. I'm gonna try the other side over here. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. This side's been tainted. <laughs> you guys showed up and dirtied the water. <laughs> Got like five feet of air on that right. This spot right here. Baris earlier, I know you were being sarcastic. You said something about a smallest and biggest fish challenge. I think that'd be a pretty hard one to beat. Yeah. I just gotta find that white, that mount. You know that little, that C-shaped pond where you were pulling them white fish out of. You go up there with a size ten. I had I this pull it off. fish. <laughs> I had to squint to see the fish. <laughs> Just got to whip it out see who's smaller. <laughs> I wish you kept track of that. Okay. Yeah, no, I'm still not set up to catch anything higher than about a 15 pounder right now. Mm -hmm. I mean, for the most part, nothing's gonna be too much bigger than that. 
This is you. I don't know. This guy came over here and shit in the lake or something. There's no fish anymore. He started whipping his poop sock around out there. Yeah. Tried to use it as bait. Thought he was chumming the waters. Yeah. I have to try a different spot. Hate to say it. Can't even catch the bronze crappy over here, and I thought it was a good idea to accept the daily challenge for a gold rank one. Yeah. You're doing the uh, Ruby River challenge? Or... No, we're not. Diamond Peak Fishing Challenge, Bronze One. Oh, you're over there. Yeah. Plus, I accepted a uh, daily challenge to try and catch a gold uh, crappy as well. That's a good um, uh, burbot spot at night. Hey, you got something, that's, that's a, a big one. Nice, 12 and a half pounder. Are baskets an option in this game? Like for split? Are mm -hmm. what? Baskets. Skyrim. Baskets. Put them over their heads. Oh. I don't think so. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't think so. I don't think he needed baskets. He used the, uh, I'm assuming they're slugs. There's a shit ton of interactables in this game. And, uh, in Starfield. Right, um, but I don't, I don't think baskets are mine. I don't I haven't seen anything that would be, like, equivalent to that in the game yet. I haven't downloaded it. I just have yet to play because I've been watching him. And play it. I've been trying to learn more about it. I got a lot of bills coming up. <laughs> I'm gonna wait a little while. See if it goes on sale. Game pass for Xbox. That's how I was able to play it. Technically, I, I can do that on the computer. Mine goes through both. Yeah. Um, because when I, because I have my controller, when I hit my home button on the controller, it opens up the, uh, Microsoft, like, Xbox window. Kind of aggravated. My my debit card got stolen again. Oh, well, my number did. So right before my payday too. So I have to wait a week for um, a new card to come in. 
which is going to come in probably like seven days after I get paid. So I got to figure out how to cash my check and then pay my bills, which are all linked to that card. Yeah, I'm not, not too happy about it. I bet. I've got money in my bank account that I can't, I can't get to. That does suck. Um, when we took our trip to Oklahoma, we were so prepared. We thought we had everything ready. We were good to go. The one thing we did not really think about is the bank we use isn't a bank that's down south. Hmm. I went on a trip. <clears throat> I went up to Colorado in like 2014, I think. And, um... We got into Oklahoma, and I went to stop at the gas station, and it declined my card. Well, trying to find out, I called my bank later. They're like, "Oh, well, your card's been used in four different states in the last couple of days, and it was flagged for suspicious activity." And uh, you know, I'm thinking like, "Well, fucking duh, I'm going on a road trip. I'm buying gas." <laughs> you know, and it took three days for them to unlock my card. It was just annoying as hell. <laughs> like, luckily, luckily my girlfriend had money in her account. We were able to use her card. Because we would have just been stuck in another state without a dime. Where did you go in OK? Uh, we were just passing through Oklahoma. I went to Tulsa. And then Ardmore. There was some... I forget where we were, but there was this... Huge like water park. It was kind of like we, what we have down here. Was, it's called Blue Bayou. It's like a uh, Blue Bayou Dixieland. It's a water park and then also a theme park next to it. They had something like that up in Oklahoma, and uh, they had the go karts that you can race. That was pretty fun. We stopped there and stayed at a hotel overnight. Mexican fluff entered the server. <laughs> Hey, I finally get invited. See some neat names in this game. <laughs> oh, they're kind of funny sometimes. Forrest, what was the one the other night? It was like Booty to Rage or something like that? Just Booty Rage. Yeah, that. <laughs> the guy caught. He kept catching nothing but small late trout, and he booty raised right out of the game. Also, sex art are not too bad of a place. Yeah, we were along the, the border of Oklahoma and Texas, and then we passed through the, um, the that top square of Texas. I don't recommend it to anybody. It was freaking awful. It was like 100 miles of cow fields, cows shoulder to shoulder, and swarms of horse flies. So thick that we had to stop four times to scrape the windshield clean so that we could see. And my truck didn't have AC. So the whole time, all we're smelling is, cat, is cow piss and shit, and we couldn't get the windows down, and it was like 100 degrees because my truck didn't have AC because the flies were so freaking bad. We were just cooking <laughs> in the truck the whole way through. I, I, I've never had a good experience in Texas, not driving through it, not visiting, nothing. Yeah, I, It's just been a miserable state for me every time I've ever been. For Ardmore, my brother wound up getting himself into some trouble. I actually posted it in Discord a while back, but I found it did. Anyway, I nearly had a heat stroke driving through El Paso. The one thing I will say I didn't like about just not even Oklahoma itself, but the, the highway system. 
like the four lane highways and the flat lands, the winds will blow you everywhere. Yeah. Oh, dude. Go to Arizona. I took my friend to California like five years ago. We were driving through Arizona and they got the sign that, that when it says when flashing, pull over to the side because then the, there's like these sandstorms that come through. And we're driving through and there's um, just off in the distance, you can see for miles. We're just watching tornadoes drop down, like, one after another. I, maybe they're dust devils or whatever. It was insane. It was one of the most apocalyptic things I've ever seen in my life. And then that night when I was driving back, uh, there was a fire. I could see it for, like, 50 miles. I don't know, the absolute worst thing we saw on our trip to Oklahoma and then back was, um, honestly, it had to be the diesel runaway because the truck, like, there was, there's very little chance of saving a diesel runaway to begin with, but this dude's truck was gone. It melted. Yeah. Yeah. It happens. Go to southeast toward Broken Bow. Oklahoma. Yeah, Arkansas not... was a nice place to drive to. Yeah, I got a lot of family that lives down in Oklahoma. I got a bunch of family in Kansas City that I've never met. I know a dozen of people that live in Oklahoma, but I only met a handful of them when I went to see my brother when he got out of the hospital like two years ago. There's your bronze crappy. Yes, you bet. All over the place then. My cat's trying to ban somebody. <laughs> Let me move my phone real quick. <laughs> Who gets the lucky hammer today? It was Glenn. <laughs> no, this is so bueno. No. <laughs> Let me get that out of there real quick. Even my cat wants to get in on the action. What am I missing? No, my cat walked over my phone just now and tried to bang Glenn. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm glad okay, I like, caught uh, that. Last week I dropped my phone and accidentally uh, banned somebody. <laughs> <laughs> it happens. I just dropped my phone and just like fat finger it. <laughs> Glenn says, screw your cat. <laughs> Sorry, Glenn. Dude, everybody else is catching the black crappy but me. And I'm in the area I'm supposed to. <laughs> I mean, it was the same thing for me with the sturgeon. I'm sitting there trying to catch a bronze sturgeon, and Ryan pulls out 10 silvers in the exact same spot. I just gave up on it after that. 
Mm. I had to put her bed down there because she wouldn't stop trying to get everything in myself. I know. <laughs> Goddamn fat cat. Office. No, you're fine. Stay in your bed. That Luna? down there and eat your bed. <laughs> kind of unusual for a cat to chew on things like that. Yeah, she, she's still a kitten, so she just like, she wants to chew on everything. <laughs> I'd rather her chew on her bed than chew on my ankles or climb up the back of my chair, jump on my head, and bite the back of my neck. <laughs> I've got the one really. Kitten kitten claws are one of the worst things in the freaking world. A little razor like blade. Razors. Yeah. <laughs> Shit hurts. Okay, we're getting close to night time again. I'm gonna head over here. I wonder if that diamond catfish is dying now.
Well, since we're getting closer to nighttime, I'm going back over to that uh, Gogger location for that town. Yeah. I was going to take it full advantage. Fred says catch Whoa. more fish, I'm hungry. Fred says catch more fish, I'm trying, Fred. <laughs> I mean, we could always go back and catch catfish. Barth, that's a spot. They're at least reliable. Thank you much there, Fred. Uh -huh. mm. Too close to the shore there. I'll be right back in the room. But. Yeah. 
I'm pretty much in a dry spot right now myself and caught nothing. Alright, I still got like another two hours in the game before it's officially nighttime. Oh yeah, we figured it out. It, you said it was like 10 seconds per minute. So that's like 10 minutes a minute. Roughly, I think. Right? So, it was 10 minutes every minute and we got Six minutes for an hour. I can't be right. Yeah. I guess so. That seems kind of fast. I do have a salmon spot marked on my map for later. I want to try out. I've not been over there. Catfish are biting. See, after the first day of watching Split Starfield, in my mind, I was like, I could play this and build a ship of massive proportions, and now actually watching everything it takes to acquire that stuff, it's like, <laughs> oh, I see, I see, I get it, it takes time. It's a lizard where the fish seem to be so far? Yeah, I think I just, drew, I think I just uh, dried this spot up. Go somewhere else for a bit. I liked some of the designs of what Split was messing around with in the shipbuilder, I think it was yesterday. See this? It almost looked like an X-Wing. Yeah. Fine, go eat your, go eat your sister. Yeah. <laughs> Freaking good shot her. <laughs> and then her freaking attacking me. Now she's on the <laughs> stage, like, why are you awake? Like, take me to bed and put my cartoons on now. <laughs> oh, there's the kitten on cartoons too. Oh, yeah, she likes Bugs Bunny. <laughs> the big cat ever booped the little cat. Oh, yeah, quite a bit. They, they, 
safe, safe, safe from rounds. <laughs> My big cat Hazy does it in the most adorable way possible. She'll never use her claws, but she will like throw a seven piece out of nowhere. <laughs> I love when cats do that, that rapid fire slap. <laughs> Oh, my, my big cat, she, she's a coward. Like she'll, <laughs> she'll act tough, but like, she, she gets her ass kicked every time by the kitten. Uh. <laughs> Been at work too much to watch uh, Starfield. We'll have to watch it all later. Oh yeah, there's a lot of hours. He's been playing the crap out of the game. Yeah. yeah. Been fun. It sort of looked like Everspace 2 at first, and then you get out, and then you start building outposts, and you can customize your own ship, and I was like, yeah, this is way cooler. Everspace 2 was cool, but this is way cooler. It makes me wonder um, what the end game is going to be like, with uh, how much you have to do, and how big you can build and everything, and... I feel like they should Fallout 76 it, and I don't mean, like, the gameplay itself, I just mean the multiplayer. There's a lot of people who are hinting at it, because there was some attention brought to the ULAs. Um, specifically because... Oh, what was it? Um, oh, there's a person... Because this game was built for, uh, AMD uh, graphics cards, um, it doesn't include the the ray tracing technology or whatever for NVIDIA, but there's somebody who modded it to be in the game, but you have to subscribe to a $5 a month thing, which is a whole nother topic, if, you know. But anyway, so in the ULA of the game, um, it actually kind of prohibits that, but there's also a lot of, um, there's a lot of wording that, Hence, towards multiplayer and rules that have only to do with multiplayer, so there's a chance that it might get it in the future, which would be awesome because it's set up for it. You know, I mean, could you imagine going around and freaking fighting other people in your ships? That'd be First, so cool. You could literally build an empire, and I don't. This isn't even trying to be a Star Wars reference. You could build an empire and fight other empires. Yeah. I just think it'd be cool to roll up in a pack and just taking down people and ships in space. <laughs> Do the Fallout 76 thing. Drop a bunch of loot you don't need and then go to see the person. If they're selling it overpriced, drop them. Never heard quick things about Fallout 76. Well, exactly what I just said is what happened to me. Somebody gave me what they called a welcome gift, and I'd never received anything like that in any multiplayer game ever, where it was just a bunch of, like, high-powered fucking excess loot. Yeah. So, couldn't use, I put in my vending machine to sell, and I was just trying to upsell it by, like, maybe two or three thousand more than what it said it was worth, just so I could get my quick buck out of it, and the person blew everything I had up, everything. That sounds like, um, I mean, I've run into people like that in RuneScape <clears throat> that give, show, give stuff to newbies. It's always pretty nice. Yeah, I thought it was nice too, but it was Cloak and Dagger because they're literally like, hey, go sell it. And then they were the first person at my vending machine, saw the prices I put and dropped a nuke on me because I was in one of those zones. Yeah, it sounds like some Rust, some stuff that would happen in Rust. <laughs> What's normally over here? Where you at? Oh, you came over here? Wait, what? Where are you? Oh, you're over there. Remember, Duffy? We, we used to catch, um... At night, there's walleye. Like, just, just walleye out your ears. But we used to catch Sauger there. 
and bass. Okay. Small mouth, large mouth, stuff like that. But you're gonna catch a ton of sauger if you hang out there at night. If you go up river, there's a bunch of bass and um, there's some rainbow trout. If you go all the way up to the waterfall, you'll find bluegill. Yeah, I'm over here for the sauger gold or the Ruby River Range map challenge three catch a gold rank sauger. Nighttime in the yeah. game, 1500 to 0600. So that's what I'm waiting for. Got something big. Okay. That and I was getting distracted by watching the split watch the sky. <laughs> There's something. I got something. I still yet to catch a big walleye though. I've caught a ton of them, but nothing significant. They look huge. Like they look like whales when you're pulling them out, and then it's only like three pounds. Okay. You know? <laughs> yeah. Like the eight pound walleye I caught it looked like it caught it looked like it was gonna weigh like twenty pounds. Yeah, <laughs> but I caught an eight point eight one pound gold walleye. It was two and a half feet long. It was 8.1? 8.81 pounds for gold. Wow, my silver is 8.5. That's, that's, like that's close. Ah, <laughs> uh -huh, yeah, you're pulling them in over there, huh? Yeah, the nighttime fish are starting to bite. Shot. Trying for another diamond, one of those. Is the orange trout? No, that's way over on the other side. Gotcha. In Lake Iridium, you got to go up to the um, the northern tip in that shallow spot. I think that was pure luck. I don't even know if that would be repeatable. Because I didn't catch a single other orange trout while I was on there. Only had them in Wisconsin and Michigan. Mm. Uh, I don't know if it's just the game model or if they're actually that big. But they look like they do good eating. I mean, the diamond's got to be close to 15 pounds, somewhere around that area. It's got to be. Okay. They look really awesome, though, in the water, because how big their fins are. Now, if you want to just catch fish, catch fish, catch fish, we could go over to Norway, and you can catch the Atlantic salmon. You get one every single cast. Every single cast.
So in the handbook, it says the walleye, also known as the yellow perch or yellow pickerel, is a freshwater fish native to Canada and most of North America. The fish is called a walleye due to its opaque, reflective eyes, which allow it to see in dark conditions. Walleyes grow to around 31 inches or 80 centimeters in length and weigh up to about 20 pounds or 9 kilograms. The maximum recorded size of the fish is 42 inches or 107 centimeters in length and 29 pounds or 13 kilograms in weight. That's huge. <laughs> A big ass fish. Yeah. I'm almost tempted to go over to Norway and catch those Atlantic salmon. They're fun to reel in. I still have to explore pretty much the entire map over there. Uh, as far as I'm concerned, there's only one spot to fish in Norway. <laughs> No, yeah, Norway still has the old spawn rate for the fish. They never fixed it. So they, the fish are just everywhere in mass numbers. I go get big. I am having absolutely no luck at all. There's nothing even nibbling right now. <laughs> oh, that was a pop. <clears throat> Talking to me. Mm. All right, waters like this, you have to fish near the sh by the shore. Is down here. A lot of. A lot of the spots in this game, as long as the water is less than, like, it's like 25 feet or, or less, you, you can catch them pretty much anywhere. Yeah. <clears throat> like the considered shallow lake areas. Unless you're going for, like, lake chart, then down by the bottom. Yeah. Now, the small fish, you catch all up on the banks and everything. But, like, this, this southern area, the main lake, it's, the whole thing is, like, at most 30 feet deep and you can literally cast anywhere and catch anything that's it's in this area it's it's crazy how how spread out everything is in this area oh i got a bite Sogger. Close. It's a good sign. I think I think two pounds is the is it uh, the gold? I've caught an almost five pound gold. I mean, I did catch eight of them back to back the other night. So 
but out of all of those, the biggest was... Oh, hold on. Yeah, 4.82 pounds, 1.68 feet. I'm just trying to level up enough to be able to reel in a bigger uh, lake trout than like 10, 15 pounds. I might try to go for the legendary. I haven't tried again since the other day. I know what it is. I just haven't gotten a fight yet. There's another one. Yeah, I'm gonna go for that last one. I have I have my doubts as to whether or not I'll be able to actually pull it in. <laughs> but it would be nice to try. Trout? I'm not sure he just said trout. There's four or five different types of trout in this game right now, I think. Yeah, I there's think, uh, brook yeah. trout, there's cutthroat trout, there's golden trout, there's lake trout, there's orid trout, there's rainbow trout. Yeah, I, th I think he's just saying just like in general. Yeah. I know the the brook trout and the cutthroat trout don't get very big. They're not there about that size. The maximum largest weight recorded for a brook trout was 15 pounds. And it was... Hold on. 34 inches long. That's pretty big. <laughs> The largest recorded for cutthroat is, oh, actually it doesn't have a largest for it, it just says 6 to 40 inches in length. Yeah, all the fish tell you most of the stats like that, um, you just have to go to the handbook and push tab over them. Lake trout, that's the big one. The lake trout is a freshwater char living mainly in lakes in northern America, northern North America. The lake trout is prized both as a game fish and as a food fish. Lake trout are the largest of the chars. The record weighed almost 102 pounds with a length of 50 inches or 127 centimeters and 15 to 40 pounds or 7 to 18 kilograms. Uh, fish are not uncommon. The average length is 24 to 36 inches. The largest caught on a rod and reel, according to the IGFA, was 72 pounds or 32 kilograms, caught in Great Bear Lake in 1995 with a length of 59 inches. do appreciate the fact that this game gives me a reason to put my reading glasses on. Yeah, I figured you were talking about the game there. 
go and try and catch a river and trout or lake one. Nowhere near those numbers. I mean, we only have one type of trout in Louisiana, it's in the salt water. <laughs> Is uh, the speckled trout. They got freaking teeth. It is not fun getting those things off the hook and they're slimy as hell. See, I was trying to use a size four hook to hopefully go for the gold, but I'm not catching anything on that. And I was catching the, I caught the two silvers on the size six with leeches. Uh, I caught mine on the uh, size size six and one, and uh, size six and red one. Yeah, it was a red one. Oh yeah, the fish over there are very tiny. I see you bubbling down there. <laughs> Small hook over there, Becky. I don't know, I'm in a dry patch again, so I'm, I'm still not getting any nibbles, and I switched my hook size and bait again. Isn't there? What's that? Um, I've, I've found that the, if you leave the hook size smaller, you have just in general a better change. It feels like this. You'll spend a lot of time not catching that. channel catfish. Founder. Woo! Noise. Big boy. Yeah, that's, that's, that's good. There we go. <laughs> that's a weak one. There. Mm-hmm. <laughs>
I'm, I'm up to 60,000 gold now. I can't even spend it on anything. I already have all the gear. Until I get the reputation points to get the CDU stuff. Did I finally get a like that? I think so. No, it's a big mustard. At this rate, I'm just going to have to fast travel back to buy more bait. Hmm. I'm back to catching stuff. It's just not anything I need.
Jin. Because you're the word. Oh, I got fish. Nice. I'm not taking off your side when you're legendary. What's I just that? figured out where it is. I'm real close to it while I was fishing. I just needed to go a little bit further west. Enough people have finally caught it to really narrow down the uh, exact spot. So, oh, what's the day? Today's the ninth, I believe. Oh, it's probably the tenth now. So we got five more days to catch it. Basically until next Wednesday. And Big Larry comes back in the rotation. We can't fish. But it does say that it Unless you have the max equipment, it does take at least 10 to 20 minutes to catch this thing, so. <laughs> I wouldn't doubt it. It is a whale. It's like, it's like pulling an 8-year-old out of the, out of a lake. It's like 100 pounds. I don't know, something about the ranger Splits talking to seems like he's uh, licked the window a time or two in his life. Seems like what? Seems like he's licked a window a time or two in his life. <laughs> I don't know, it's just something about the way the character, like, cocks his head to the side when he's, like, mid-conversation. Back to a dry spot, like nothing.
pickles. God, I don't know what I just got myself into. This guy's got the 100 pound pole, and he's barely able to set the drag. This thing is pulling him all the way into the road. Gonna lay on my arm. Yeah, you better not move either. You get the razor. <laughs> no, she's literally like I picked her up and she latched onto my arm. She's got her arm wrapped around it. Not just like, holding her with my one hand on her. But, but <laughs> I'm, like, I'm like one hand to fish and drink beer, the other hand to control the puma. Uh -huh. Across Here, that person's face bar when it comes to it. Yeah. The three pound soccer, huh? You're getting close, man. So close yet so far away. Here. Luna, you need to go take a shit, dude. <laughs> dude, she just farted on me. It's like the grossest kittens. <laughs> She's dusting me, dude. She just farted and made my eyeball immediately start watering. Dude, dude, you you gotta go drop one, dude. You got one. You got one in the chamber. I smell it. <laughs> She's so tiny, but she's so smelly. <laughs>
Twelve buckets clay. Just getting in at Ruby River Range if you need me. Got you down here. Hey, you got it. Nice. Nice. That one was tiny. Three point six one one uh, pound, one point two three footer. I got 1,200 coins, 35 reputation, a couple of rods, five gold medals, and a whole bunch of other stuff for that. Damn it, I came all the way over here and I put... I got the wrong face. I just don't. I've never known anybody to go through that much for Right? Take 
take my hand, I take your foot, just press my space bar. Whoa. <laughs> Hey, that's a big wall, huh? I think there is a third person in this game, I just don't remember what... third person in this game? I, I thought there was. I don't think so. I... What happened? I'm, I know there's no third person in the vehicle, for sure. Here, push some buttons, see what happens. <laughs> In the middle, or? I just figured out how to hide the UI. <laughs> really, there's a quick button for that? I never checked any of this shit. What's that one do? Wow. This whole time I've had um, quick keys on my D-pad and I didn't know about it. How many hours I've played this game and never noticed that? <laughs> I a lot. Jesus. I don't know, Glenn. I thought there was. Pushing every button I can on my keyboard. Where's my fishing pole? It's just gone. You lose your fishing pole? It's no longer in my menu. What the hell? Is it in storage or something? Oh, here it is. <laughs> I don't know, that was weird. It was just gone for a second. Alright. Coming for you, sideline. Here. Before I move, found a couple of walleye, but that's about it. You come try to get wall uh, sidewinder with me, Debbie. <laughs> You need a, a 4 0 heavy jig with a worm.
cat almost cost me my catfish. <laughs> catfish. Definitely stuff here. I was just trying to catch them. Stop scratching my ass. I'm trying to fish. Luna's trying to crawl up my ass. That moment when 10 different NPCs try to talk to you at the same time. Oh, there you go. Ten pounds, too.
What? <laughs> I'm trying not to fall asleep, but I said Dopey found a good catfish spot.
You got a 12 pounder catfish there. Yeah, I struggled with that one for a good solid minute and a half. I bet. That's not a sturgeon. to use your fur to warm my feet. No, don't run away. <laughs> Come on, to get spooled. <laughs> it's gone, like 200 feet. Gone. Nothing I can do about it. Oh, shit. Hey, Super Ren, how's it going?
Uh, the angler. I was sucking that notion and split. <laughs> I'm getting tired too. Yeah, I don't know what the hell I just hooked into, but it was way too big. Uh, it's 5 a.m. here. Damn, dude. Like, it's like 2 a.m. here. Oh, Jesus, is it? Damn, it's already 4 o'clock in the morning? Yeah, Varus. <laughs> you guys uh, splitting dope here three hours behind me, and you're only an hour behind me. Not too bad. I just had a, I was trying to use my small line to catch this surgeon that I'm supposed to be getting and I must have hooked into like a a big ass catfish or something because it just it completely ran all of my line out just gone. Like, <laughs> You're a oh, newer man. technician there, Superman? That's Can I use bait? Where'd you catch the uh, tiger muskie? Yeah, I'm trying to catch a silver one for a mission. Who are you talking to? You want a tiger muskie? Uh, size 6 swim bait works really well. Alright, because I'm using a size 5 swim bait. Uh, yeah. No, spin bait. You said size what? 6 swim bait? Swim bait, yeah, the little fish. Frog style flutters of all sizes. Yeah, not not much of a fisher in real life, but it was pretty.
definitely chill. It'll chill you right to sleep. <laughs> Especially when you're not catching nothing late at night. It's so easy to doze off playing this game. Because it's so calm and quiet. The water sounds, you know? This was not the right unit. <laughs> no. <laughs> By the end of it, I was just like so tired. Yeah. I had to stay awake for like another three hours after that because my lawnmower guy came. We had to just keep talking to keep ourselves awake because we weren't freaking catching anything. Yeah. I think we managed to walk our way almost all the way around. The, um, what area was that? The Ruby River. That whole lake. We, like, we almost did the entire thing. Trying to catch catfish. That was dumb. Splitting his, uh, his wiener. <laughs> Quit swinging his wiener around. Alcoholic. What did you just say? <laughs> Is it you're not an alcoholic as long as you don't drink alone? <laughs> yeah, you're not an alcoholic as long as you don't drink alone. Why well, hang out with you guys all the time? Do <laughs> the cats? Yeah, I hope so. <laughs> of course, I hope so. Pulling in them tigers now, huh? Jeez. I know, right? <laughs> I like catching whatever fish will my wiener. Yeah. You're actually fishing with the wiener? I was there for a while. <laughs> nice. Oh, you guys are down by the dam. I've heard that there's good tiger and pike there, but I've never really caught any. Ask me about my Luna. At this rate, I'm about to just go make myself some eggs with bagels and corned beef hash. Damn, they're just getting bigger down here. Nice. I mean, it is breakfast time here.
just want a little tiny sturgeon. Just one little bronze tiny sturgeon. That's all I need. Yeah, I'm yeah, still trying. Oh. I'm trying to get the musky still. Wait, did I just get it? Five twelve a.m. for you there, Superman. All right. Surgeons are scary when you have a 12 pound line. Well, yeah. <laughs> I don't ever want to see another catfish. <laughs> I'm I bet you don't. Because both of the challenges that I'm struggling with right now are just. They're just massive amounts of catfish. In both spots. It doesn't make any sense. Is the catfish the only thing dumb enough to eat it and burn anything? Yeah. Better than catching nothing. Hey, Bob, yeah. I'll be down the Emerald Lake Plateau outpost in a flash if you need me. See you there. Me. Got another mission for to catch a still. Is it a silver sturgeon? Or is it a gold? Oh, it's a gold burbot. That's a big one. I forget to just keep catching those. I'd like, be happy with that. They can make an ultimate boss battle for this game and just make it so you have to go noodling for giant catfish. You don't know. <laughs> My feet is just all tiger musky. <laughs> That's a nice spot you found there. Yeah, I know. I haven't even had to move out of this one spot. I just keep rotating. 
Yeah, that's how you know you got a good one. <laughs> I'm about ready to try just about anything to get this damn fish. What do I need to do? Got a lot of spinner bait. Alright. No way. Twisted, I should have just fucking listened to you. Size 8 spinner. Did you get it? Told yeah. you. <laughs> I just... It's not even supposed to bite the spinner. Oh, that you had to use the spinner. Son of a bitch. <laughs> I'm gonna go up to the fucking, um... My sunfish spot and use a size 8 spinner. And if I catch it, I think I'm gonna rage quit. Because <laughs> I used to fish with like exclusively the, the size A spinner because just freaking everything would bite it of all sizes. <laughs> it really is just stupid how well this bait works. I'll split my deep before I get over there. <laughs> They don't pile your fish up in your boat. I'd be sinking by now. <laughs> what does the word row, R O E, mean? Fish eggs. Row. Okay. Yeah, it's, it's what they call it. Like caviar, whatever. It's like fancy word. That is one of the things that Shovel No Sturgeon are uh, highly regarded for, as well as their flesh. Yeah. Mm. That was eggs, yeah. yeah, that was going to be my next question was how to say, and I'm assuming it's caviar. Basically, well, caviar is specific, I think, from a certain type of fish. Yeah, sturgeon. Oh, okay. Uh, I think that's just gross. <laughs> you can keep it. I'm reading the um, the handbook log for sturgeon in the game. Ah, uh, okay. In 2010, they were actually listed as threatened under the U.S. Endangered Species Act due to their uh, resemblance to the endangered pallid sturgeon. Even hair of sturgeon until I played, until they should put them in the game. I mean, I've heard the the word sturgeon before, but I didn't know what it. I had no idea what they looked like. 
Okay, so white sturgeon are one of the largest species of sturgeon in the world, and they can grow in excess of 12 to 20 feet. Yeah. They're actually one of the most commonly misinterpreted fish for being a lake monster because they are giant armored fish. Yeah. You and see that. They're known for like torpedoing people's boats and knocking them out of the boat and dragging them down. <laughs> that would suck. <laughs> Jesus. Asshole fish. Yeah, they're violent. Um, you remember River Monsters? Jeremy Wade did like three episodes on it. What you guys plan on going for? No clue. <laughs> I'm probably gonna call. Yes. <laughs> I do have a challenge for a silver rank surgeon. And a silver rank verbot. I'm just gonna choose. Fighting my eyelids more than I am catching fish at this point. Dude. Yeah. Damn. Tiger musky, tiger musky, tiger musky, tiger musky, tiger musky. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Dude, this is like every five seconds. If I didn't have to stand in the spot that I'm in, I would definitely go there to try and catch one. You know what? I gotta get a piece of that. <laughs> that looks like fun. Like, I literally have not moved. Did anybody answer what noodling is? No. Noodling is when you go out catfishing and instead of using any type of line and hook, you're using your literal arm or leg. Yeah, see, that's Please. what I thought, but I... Yeah. <laughs> I was gonna say something stupid like that's what happens when you stick your wiener. <laughs> you fish with your wiener. <laughs> Well, I mean, that'd be a pretty fair answer, too. You know, there's a lot of different names for it, but noodling's always what I uh, heard it called. You're still fishing? Yeah, you're fishing with the hot dog, aren't you? Yeah, I'm not. Hmm. I don't want to have a hot dog. I'm using the minnows for this. Oh, uh, okay. I was using the hot dog for the catfish. I bought 99 for everything. <laughs> I got tired of running out. But yeah, I've been going... I went through like 5 or 6 stacks of 99. <laughs> Here, these last couple days has been kind of extreme. I'm looking at a 
Big ass fish right in front of me. Hey, man, just throw that man and grab it. Oh, wrong bait. No, no, it was awesome to get a, uh, a weekend stream from you guys. So glad to see you guys enjoying some games. Glad to get to participate, but I'm gonna have to go to bed. Yeah, no problem. Get some sleep. Yes. Not good. Alright, I'll have a good one. You too. He's like right there. Come on. You're gonna wait until it gets all the way up to my boat again. It is 200 feet deep right here. Dude, I know it. Oh, crap. Hey. That was a big one. I kind of wish it would let you walk around on your boat. Yeah, It'd I know. Nice. All you do is just spin around. I mean, you can change seats, but it's not quite the same. That's one of the two different spots, you Yeah.
Oh, nice. What the fuck is that? A burbot. This one is the new fish. Oh, first one, I, I get a gold? Yeah. My, <laughs> my second Damn. one was a diamond. I caught it out of nowhere. Just... <laughs> Damn. Yeah, what up?
Okay, come down for that and see if there's anything on decent size. Let's see. Yeah. Because it could be like a thousand bronze, but a couple of gold will never get them. <laughs> yeah. You can throw a size one out here and see what happens. There's a smudge or something on my TV that looks like a fish under the water. And it tricks me constantly. <laughs> it's like in the perfect spot to where it looks like it's underneath the bother. I feel that. I got a smudge of mite on my uh, monitor. <laughs> it's gone into at least 10 times by now. <laughs> Maybe that's a little too big.
I got something on the size three hook. It's big. Let's go. It's gotta be at least a silver. Oh my. Almost 14 50. pounder there. Another big one. This one might might be bigger than the last one. It's falling apart. It's a damn good spot. Dude, I know, right? Holy shit. You can put custom markers down now on your map, too. You can put a marker down for just being a special spot. And you can also put a marker down for each level, like bronze, silver, gold, diamond. Legendary, and then you click on that marker again, and you can label for like the specific fish. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, another thirteen pounder. Damn. That's on the size three. See, and there are big ones out here. You just oh, gotta yeah. eliminate that small hook. Yeah, I'm working with a, a size four. All right. I might step up to a size two in a minute, see if it continues. I'll catch a couple more. Yeah. See if I can't work my way up to a size one and get a gold. <laughs> Something's over there. Got another one. Holy crap. It's about the same size, too. Oh, this one's actually swimming towards me. Gotta love when that happens.
All right. So, sorry, two. Girl, stop fighting. Never mind. Nice. Yeah. Yes. You got one too. With, guess what I got it with? I got it with a wiener. One. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Don't these wiener skills are. <laughs> She's got those expert wiener skills. What was this is what was the lead on Oh yeah. God, you're the only thing on my uh on my feed. Yeah. <laughs> All tiger musky except for that one. Well, there's two. That's crazy. <laughs> I can't I got that with a wiener. <laughs> For a diamond, that thing didn't fight at all. Just like take me, <laughs> give me more yeah, winners. Kind of... <laughs> 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 
Yeah. I don't think there's anything big enough over here for this. For this. So, try over here. Ooh, that one waited till it got all the way up to the. Oh, it's huge! It's huge! It's it's too big for my uh line that I'm using. 
I'm gonna have to fight this one. Don't you snap my line. Clear back. I'll cry like a little girl.
luck, Rue. I'm down at Silver Strand Meadow now, if you wanted to drop by.
never caught anything in my phone. Never caught anything. Oh. The diamond. I see pike all around me, but I don't think they're big enough for the space I'm using. I got kind of gold when you walk away. <laughs> like 16 pounds. You had to have leveled up a couple of times, huh? I mean, yeah, it's possible.
there. Fancy a new rod? They'd be flying off the shelves if I had any. What piques your interest? I beached my boat. You beached your boat? Yeah. They hit a freaking sandbar. And I'm in the middle of a river, too. It's so tall. Anywhere where I can get across? Just look like it.
There's a fast travel right here. Son of a bitch. <laughs> I've been going way out of my way to get over here. something next time. Okay. I have beach from the boat again. Man. Uh, there's so many big boulders in this river. It's ridiculous. They gotta, they gotta give us third person to drive the boats at some point. It makes it so hard yeah. to see where you're going, especially with these rocks and sandbars and shit.
Who's being grumpy? <laughs> He lost his ship already. I get you.
Oh, the busky started biting it in, huh? Different spot. Ah, okay. It's daytime again. I gotta go try and get my freaking sunfish. Have fun. Mm. I'm trying the eight spinner this time. That way I don't catch a thousand catfish. <laughs> Hit the shit out of that boulder. The whole front of my Jeep phased into it. Islands. Let's see. Wait. The Ruby River Range Outpost. There's a little island right outside, right across from the pier. That area usually has a bunch of them. Damn. Oh, you're already getting them anyway. Am yeah, I? I'm getting them anyway. <laughs> Just not as often because I'm using a. No.
Yeah. One after another. Post.
It scared the shit out of me. I was half falling asleep and I got a huge bite. Yes. <laughs>
Found a Bigfoot shark. Found a Bigfoot shark, is that what you just said? Bigfoot track? Oh, yeah. I don't see it. But it did pop up on the thing. To report it. <laughs> Oh, I found the salmon. Finally. Crap. 
Salmon don't even get that big. What the fuck did I just hook into? Sucked into a huge sand. And I don't think I'm gonna be able to pull it in. Damn it. It can't be that big unless it's a fucking diamond. It's been at 90 feet for a minute now. <laughs> Come on. The sad part is, when it hit my line, it was only 20 feet away from me. Stop fighting. Get over here.
I don't even think it's a salmon now. I think it's a rainbow trout. It is a fucking rainbow trout. Damn it. Damn. Holy shit. I just pulled that in on a five pound pole. That is stupid. <laughs> Five pound pole. <laughs> All right. Um. Let's get another one. Damn it, this time. Dang. No, it's a cutthroat trout. Better spot.
All right, well, I think I'm going to wrap things up. Get off here for the night. All right. All right. You have yourself a good one. Yeah. Thanks for playing. Yeah, it was fun. It's been a while. <laughs> no doubt. Yeah. I'll catch you later. Bye, Nico. Yeah, I'm jumping. Alright, guys, it's about. I'm there. It's been about 17. I would like to go this in my dark room before I see the sun. Before I turn into a raisin. So. I'll catch you guys later.